Hi everybody, welcome to my Kudos Kitchen and I am Renee. And if you've been here before, welcome back. Um, I might look a little bit different to you than last time you saw me. And if you've never been here before, let me just explain. I'm going through um, some chemotherapy and that's the reason for the bald head. So hopefully you're not catching too much glare with the lights. Ah. <laughs> Today, what I would love to show you is how to shred and squeeze the excess water from zucchini. This is a very important process to do, especially especially if you're going to be baking with zucchini um, because the excess water can really wreak havoc with your end product and make it watery and change the consistency tremendously. So this is very important to do. I um, mean, it's very easy to do. And today I'm gonna to show you three different methods I'm going to show you the easy box grater that I'm sure most everybody, everyone has in their kitchen. Um, I have this kind of grater that I love and use it for like shredded cheddar cheese and it'll also work well for the zucchini and it's, it's quicker and um, doesn't take as much effort as the box grater. And then of course the handy dandy food processor. Um, which probably a lot of you do have in your kitchen. So, so I will show you all three methods. First I cut the two ends off of the large zucchini. Then I used an impeccably clean kitchen towel and I used the box grater and grated the zucchini directly on top of the towel. And now I gather up the corners of the kitchen towel and grab a bowl, because you're gonna need it, and squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. You'll be amazed at how much liquid and water comes out of the zucchini. Here's method two, using the kitchen countertop grater. Basically the same, only it's a little bit easier. Again, you'll notice I'm grating right on top of the clean kitchen towel. And now the same method for gathering up the corners and squeezing your zucchini dry. And the last method is the very fast and easy uh, food processor using the shredding blade. And by now you know the routine of adding it to the kitchen towel, gathering up the corners, and giving it a squeeze. Okay, so we go, went ahead and we shredded up two very large zucchini and out of those two very large zucchini, I think I got probably at least four to five cups of shredded zucchini that we squeezed, that I squeezed the water out. I showed you how to squeeze the water out and out of those, I'm going to say we probably got about two to two and a half cups of liquid. Now, if you wanted to, you could add this liquid to your morning smoothies or add it to some soup stock or, oh gosh, you can think of a million things to do with it. Um, of course, I can't think of a million things right now, but um, don't, don't just throw it away. You can drink it straight too. Why not? Thank you for joining me today. Um, what I'm going to be doing with this um, shredded zucchini now is my plan to make uh, a gingerbread zucchini cake and also uh, some zucchini ricotta cookies and I will link those down below once I've made them and they're on my blog, Kudos Kitchen by Renee. And I will also link the products that you see here that I use today if you're interested in maybe purchasing them um, affiliate links. So anyways, have a great day and thanks for shredding zucchini with me. See you later, bye.